All right, time to go return the uh, XC4 I rented. What an amazing weekend. What an amazing weekend. Well, that was easy. Uh, when you rent from LensRental.com, they make it super easy to send it back, you know? Uh, they give you the little tape to retape the box and a return label and you drop it off at a location that uh, picks up. That's it. I love it. By the way, the boys and girls over at Lens Rental, it's, it's loud out here. Um, they're fabulous, man. I needed to extend my days because I did not have my original camera back from repair yet and they were absolutely fabulous on making sure I was taken care of. <laughs> Good Lord, man, my day has begun. Thank you, Lens Rental, for everything that you've done. Thank you. What, what is that sound? There's an airport not far from here. Can y'all hear that? Oh, you have to hear that. What is that? Landing or taking off? Oh, it's one of those small like Lear jets. Nice looking uh, Lear jet too. So this weekend started off on Friday with the wedding of Lonnie and Paul. Two amazing human beings. Their fashion and style is off the charts, but most importantly for me is their family and friends were an absolute joy to celebrate their wedding with. They were not all from here, so they appreciated New Orleans. They got a kick out of the second line in the street, but to be with Lonnie and Paul and see them just be in love and have fun, and I love a lot of candids. I like a lot, a lot of moments that happen and I can just kind of like back up and you know sniper shoot. Those are my favorite kind of images, honestly, because um, they're real, you know, they're real moments. You're doing your job, cameras to your face, and you're, uh, you know, you got the squeezies happening and you're making all the moments get captured so you can show everybody later. And uh, what, what a, a joy it was to be their photographer. So Lonnie and Paul, thank you, thank you, thank you for being amazing and having me there as your photographer. Saturday was my anniversary gift to my wife, Elizabeth. It was for both of us actually, but it was to her. We went to go see Carrie Underwood in concert. Now, neither one of us has ever seen her in concert, so this was a an experience that was beyond off the charts. First of all, Jimmy Allen, uh, a new rising star, opened up for her. And what I appreciated about Carrie was she left nothing on the table. When I tell you she performed two hours with no intermission, several changes of clothes, the way she took care of the crowd, we were on the floor, okay, the seats on the floor, so there's the floor section and then there's like seats that you can have, and then right behind us was the PA guy, the sound guy, you know, but then they had this little black, little black stage right behind the PA guy, so the way the arena goes, she got up from the stage on a swing. They carried her all the way across above us, okay, on the floor, all the way to behind the PA people, sat her down on that little stage, and she performed a few songs for the people in the back that didn't have the best view. That's absolutely, sincerely incredible. What a way to take care of your audience. And when I tell you she was jaw-dropping amazing, her, her range, man, her vocal range is just ridiculous. Um, so anyway, what an amazing gift for Elizabeth and I to share that experience, share that moment. But me being a musician and my love for live entertainment, um, it's great to have my wife there and experience that with me. Um, it's much nicer than having to go back and tell a story about the concert. It's always great when she's there too and we're both 
in tears at the same time. We're both having those wow moments at the same time. And uh, I couldn't think of a better person to have uh, has shared that concert with. So I'm getting a few people asking me, hey GK, are you going to upgrade to the X-T5? Uh, the answer is I believe so. I have worked with one of their newer cameras that shares that same chip and focusing, um, autofocusing, and it is super sticky. Like, it locks on. You know, you click it on the eyes, man, it's, it's like Velcro. It's hard to peel it off of the subject, which I truly appreciate while doing these kinds of uh, events that I do. The other thing is too, is that going from 26 megs to 40, now you're doubling the quality of your image, which also means if you're a working photographer like myself, or you're just a photographer who enjoys printing your work, you know, on a larger scale, or you're doing albums or anything of that nature, um, which I do, that's where the megapixels um, will be noticeable, is in the prints. So if you take an image from the X-T4 and the 5, you put them side by side, you're not going to be able to tell the difference until you zoom in like 200 plus percent. And you have to tell yourself, zooming in that much is the equivalent of blowing up, enlarging an image for print for your wall. So when you zoom in 200 percent, that is the quality that you can go bigger or better or even your normal size prints will look that much sharper, you know? So yeah, I'm probably gonna upgrade. Uh, I may rent the camera first. It depends on, uh, depends on the fall season. How busy are we? <laughs>